to show the effort to value uh, was a really important thing. We wanted to do more from a digital marketing standpoint across all of these different areas with less effort in each of these individual areas. So, you know, presenting A, the data around that burning platform was, um, you know, really powerful. And then B, um, you know, showing some of the experiments that we've been able to show that I showed that, you know, 300 plus percent increase in click through rates, um, you know, in conversion rates on, on the homepage and, and service page respectively, um, really got people thinking. And then I think an important part of this as well that I really encourage you is to really, if you are in B2B and if you are in a, a brokerage or a transaction um, um, versus a kind of a purchase uh, a company, to really do as much as you can to attribute um, the purchases back up the customer journey. So um, that was something that my team um, uh, built from, from the ground up, which was to say, you know, when leads come through um, and we're handing them off to a broker or handing them off to a, per, a certain area of the business, making sure we understand where did this start? Did this start on a Google search? Did this start on a social, you know, paid campaign? Did this start on an organic social? Where did it go to? Uh, and, and what was the value to the business? Because if personalization helped to, to drive that, that is a huge, huge, huge uh, win for you. And it gives, um, um, you know, the, the business and not just the marketing team, the kind of ideas that, you know, the, the lift that this does give. And it just doesn't just look like a, you know, a vanity metric to the business. So, you know, attribution is a big way to do it. And also, you know, sharing the results of those early tests. There are best practices of user experience across uh, desktop, mobile, and tablet breakpoints that you don't have to reinvent. Um, there are um, best practices of testing and optimization of whatever the case may be, accessibility, SEO best practices. And rather than spending too much time reinventing and tooling with that, I would make sure that your data and your um, input and output metrics are really sound um, because that's the kind of thing that will allow you to evolve and quote unquote complicate your experiences over time in a way that's positive.